Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 9 of the third season of Sinfo Gear today. And it looks like uh, Carol is back and she can apparently see things through Elf 9, so that's something um, uh, bad and uh, the girls uh, aren't uh, aware uh, of this. Um, and yeah, there's um, a lot of things that left me intrigued, so uh, the moment uh, Carol uh, appeared um, again, uh, she was saying that... Um, or at least she was hearing what Ibiki was saying, um, and uh, it was about how they are becoming uh, stronger and having uh, a lot more potential. So this is something that actually pleased uh, Carol, and she said that uh, um, this will make uh, uh, things um, speed up um, a lot, so the end of all creation uh, will come um, uh, sooner because of how these girls uh, are becoming uh, so strong. Um, so, I don't know if, um, like, I don't know, this goes back to these dolls and how uh, they were always trying to make these girls um, give um, them all. So, right now, the two dolls that got um, destroyed, um, I believe they are at that place where, where Carol currently is, and it's like uh, they gathered the, like, sort of data... I'm not too sure if I should put it like this, uh, but it's like uh, they are there and um, they are still doing something. So it's like these fights against uh, Ibiki and the others uh, were um, always um, part of the plan and the, uh, these dolls were supposed to uh, be like killed at some point. Um, but yeah, there's uh, like this is me thinking about uh, or like... Um, making a guess about how things uh, are happening, but I will need to see um, for sure what exactly Carol uh, is um, thinking, so the exact details about um, her plan. Um, so yeah, with this, just really can't wait to see what's going to happen during this um, episode. So, hope you guys are ready, and let's start it. It was already crazy enough to see that she's back. Also, I want to believe that Elf9 isn't aware, uh, aware of this. That Carol can see through her. Yeah, that gives a big advantage. To Carol, it's like she... It's easy for her to know what these girls are planning and stuff. I don't know, it, it crossed my mind in case Elf-9 was being used and that this was all part of Carol's plan. If maybe... Carol always wanted them to have this um, like relic, the Dine's Life, I believe. So they could get more power, and with that, uh, Carol would get more uh, data or something. It's, it's the way I find to put it, I guess. It's, it's like she's collecting stuff from all of these, so she can achieve um, her goal. But yeah, it's it's really it's really cool when um, they do things like this. There's a lot happening and stuff, and you can only make some guesses unless you are like really smart and instantly figure everything out. It's nice to be to slowly learn about all the details. Ooh. Last less spare body. Oh damn. So that's her last body. Hmm. 
Yeah, it's... It was those memories in the end that enabled this. Oh, her father. Hmm. And it wasn't pretty, that meeting between them. Oh, damn, she's back. That's where she grew up. Neptune's Palace. Hmm. Oh. So they were after that. Oh, that's why they're there. He's not even, like, talking with her. Damn. Damn. And there's a lot of family problems. Not just like Ibiki and her father, but also these. Itsubasa. Now this one is here. I wonder if Chris and the others are going to have to face the other one. There's still two auto scorers, so. And Carol herself. And Subasa always looks so cool. Ooh. 
Oh, damn. And that was like a, a ninja. Drawing kunais or something. Yeah, it's quite sad to see this. It's like she... Went away for a really long time, so her father didn't like that. And she didn't keep in touch, so... Like, stay in touch. Oh, damn! It's happening again? Oh, it's because of that. So it's something... It's I'll... I have the effect if I can swords. Oh, she destroyed it. So wait, this is only effective against swords or something defined as a sword? Damn, that makes it really hard for Tsubasa to, to face her. Almost impossible. Oh. So the other one is there. Actually, both of them. Damn. And I'm almost sure that Carol knows. About... I don't know how to put it, like, how that specific auto-scorer is really effective against Tsubasa, so... She sent her there on purpose. That specific one. Yeah, still trying to figure out. What she really wants. Ooh. Hmm. That's nice. Hmm. Yeah, that's a sad part. And she's really not okay, Maria. 
I like how she's standing standing up for Tsubasa. Oh my god, it's just like... <laughs> it's a big mess. I still remember when she was at the hospital or something. It was like this. Damn, that's so beautiful. <laughs> oh. Damn, she was the one. Wait. It was her grandfather who... Man, that was... So her grandfather made her mother pregnant and then Tsubasa was born? Wait, that makes... Wait, her grandfather should be her mother's father, right? So it's like... That guy... Made... His own... Daughter pregnant? To give birth to Tsubasa and the, the heir? And make her become the heir of the, the family? That's really messed up. As far as I understood, at least, that was... Really came out of nowhere. Damn. And Subasa's situation is much more... complicated... than I thought. That's really messed up. If I got that right, what her grandfather did. Man, this song. Really like it. It's not going to end well. It's breaking. And I feel so sad about Subasa now. Ooh. 
And that's nice. Oh, damn, that detail. That was probably it. Man, this is something. Are we going to get a new song as well? And this this episode is already impressive, like things changing so fast, my perspective. Damn, she looks so cool. Oh! It's right it! Wait, maybe she can come up with something new, instead of a sword? Oh! Damn, she was doing that thing with her legs! Damn! And she's like a phoenix or something. Okay, that's really awesome. Man, that was so cool. This one is gone as well now. She stopped it. This guy is back. Oh my god. Wait, he's also involved? I knew that he wasn't dead or anything, but... He's actually involved with this situation as well. And that's really triggering. I can't stop thinking about this this moment with Subaza. That was so epic. Her becoming like like a phoenix. Just really beautiful. And again, the way they did all of this. I don't know, they're just really good at doing it, like, giving you an idea of how someone is, and then, uh, during the same episode, making you change your opinion about that person, so... After things got explained... I mean, at the start, I was not enjoying what, like, how Subasa's father was... 
behaving and not really caring about Tsubasa, even even if she was like gone for a long time and didn't really say anything to him during some years. But yeah, then they explained a lot, and if I got that explanation right, it's really sad for Tsubasa how things happened. There's more. Oh, there's a lot of missed calls. I mean, not really missed, she's like ignoring. Oh, she turned it off. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what could happen between Ibiki and her father. It's, again, really hard for her to... To get along with him after the things she heard, how he has, like, not a single care in the world. He's not even, um, like... Regretting the things he did, and it's it's like a I don't know it's it's basically what I already said. Like he's he's um, not really doing things right and like caring about uh, his family. So yeah, it's uh, again I still have hopes that things will become better between them, but uh, I will have to um, to see what ends up um, happening. Um, but yeah, this uh, this episode was definitely mostly focused on Tsubasa, and it was really, um, really nice in a way to learn about uh, more details of her life and to understand um, her situation, um, like mostly her family situation, a lot better. Uh, but it was sad uh, at the same time because uh, she just revealed some uh, uh, like really dark uh, moments of. Um, her life and how, like it all started with um, her birth. So that was um, really messed up what uh, her grandfather did. And again, this is all if uh, I got that right. It's pretty much how I understood it. But yeah, it's um, it, it, it's again. It was really nice to see her father then um, like saying those things to Tsubasa. So in the end, he wasn't. Uh, he was always caring about Tsubasa, and uh, Maria noticed that. Uh, because of um, a room, so there wasn't any dust or anything, so implying that uh, her father was always trying to keep um, a room um, at least, um, like, not um, organized, because it was still pretty messy, uh, but at least uh, he was taking care of it, so cleaning the dust and stuff, and uh, pretty much um, keeping the room uh, clean. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's really beautiful to see this, and uh, uh, it's good for Tsubasa, because uh, we all know how much... Uh, how much pressure she has and how she always feels like um, she needs to be this ward and stuff and... I don't know, it's just um, really stressful for her. Uh, so this will hopefully give her um, like more uh, room to breathe and to follow her dreams. So that was definitely something that um, I enjoyed uh, a lot. And again, she looked really awesome um, doing those um, attacks and making those uh, like wings of fire, looking uh, kind of like um, a, um, a phoenix. So yeah, definitely enjoyed um, these moments. And now Dr. Fur is back, so I want to, to see what exactly is um, also up to, because... Now I kind of feel like um, he was always um, together with uh, uh, Carol, but I might be wrong. Maybe he's just stepping in to achieve something of uh, his own, and maybe Carol doesn't even know about him. At least I don't remember her being in touch uh, with Dr. Ver. Like, I'm, I'm trying to remember something from the very first uh, episodes of this season. Um, but uh, I don't think uh, that was uh, the case. So the second season uh, ended with uh, him um, like not uh, being killed. So we all knew that uh, uh, eventually he was going to like be back. Uh, but I wasn't expecting it to be this soon. So definitely can't wait to see what exactly is um, going to happen now. So hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode. And if you did, please... Leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.